Breaking news out of the capital city this morning. Large police presence surrounded a crash right near Broad Street and Vermont Avenue. This is in the Washington Park neighborhood. Eyewitness News was first on the scene. We want to go live to Eyewitness News reporter Brandon Truitt for an update. Patrick, Danielle, good morning to you. Well, Providence police clearing the scene at around 3.30 this morning. While they are gone, there is still quite a bit of a mess on the road and surrounding sidewalks. I want to take you in to show you what is at the center of this crash. You can see this traffic control box that has just been smashed. It is torn to pieces. The intersection here, the traffic lights are currently out as traffic continues to pick up throughout the morning. I want to take you to the video. This is what it looked like when our crews arrived at 1.45 this morning. You can see a large police presence along Broad Street here. This happening, as you mentioned, near the intersection of Vermont Avenue. Now, we are still working to learn more about the car at the center of this, what direction it might have been coming from. But you can see the results of the impact debris all over the road. The driver making a mangled mess of that traffic box. There is severe damage to the front end of the car. Police were seen inspecting both the inside and outside of it. National Grid was also on scene early this morning. And as we're back out here live, there are still several questions as to to the nature of this incident. Clearly, there was a crash here, but in terms of who might have been transported to the hospital, if anyone was anyone else in the car aside from the driver, we have called police multiple times this morning trying to get some information for them. So far, they are remaining tight lipped as to what exactly happened here. As soon as we get the information, we'll be sure to pass it right along to you. Live in Providence, Brandon Truitt, Eyewitness News.